Hi, my name's Antoinette Griffin. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to talk about one simple three letter word that you can start using in your vocabulary that's going to improve your communication and connection with others. This is something that I just recently started doing this year. If you were to ask me, what is the biggest change that you made in your communication skills this year? I would say it's with this one change in my vocabulary. Because ever since I started doing this, I noticed three things as a result. First, I've noticed that my message is received better by other people that I'm talking to. Secondly, I've noticed that I actually feel better on the inside when I use this word. And thirdly, I've noticed that I substitute it for a word that I used to use a lot that really was preventing connections with others in conversation. So what's the word? The word is and. And what do you use it to substitute? You use it to substitute for the word but. Think about it this way. If you're on the receiving end of this conversation where somebody is using and or but, you're introducing an idea or you're expressing a thought or opinion and the other person says, yes, but it can feel deflating. It can feel like everything that you've said before doesn't really count because they have something that they want to add in contrast to what you've said before. And sometimes if it's an opinion or idea that you feel strongly about and another person introduces their thoughts on it and starts out with, but it can almost put you on the defensive because you feel like that they haven't heard you or they feel like the, that they don't value the, the idea or the opinion or the feeling that you just expressed. However, when they start to speak and they say, and whatever they say, it signals that they have validated what you've said. They don't disagree with what you've said and they're going to add to it. And so it immediately helps you as the receiver of this accept what they're saying in a more positive way. Now, I used to use but a lot in my conversations, not because I wanted to be negative or not because I wanted to shoot down someone's idea. I just wanted to bring up something else or maybe to bring up something that they hadn't thought of before. Sometimes it was contrasting. However, I realized in almost any conversation, you can use and versus but, you still get your point across and it is received much better. I've noticed since I started using and instead of but, I feel better as well. I feel like I'm building on what the other person said rather than tearing down what they said. So now that you're aware, I wanna challenge you to use the word and instead of but. You're gonna see that you can almost always use it and you're gonna see not only a difference in the way that your communication is received by others, but you're gonna see a difference in the way that you feel on the inside as well. If you have liked this video, I hope you will press like and I hope you will subscribe to my channel.